Hey everyone, I'm Mohamed Leela, and this is your holiday edition of The Goodable Show. Ho, 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 ho. Let's get straight to our top story this week, and before we do, a warning, you may need to get out the tissues for this one. <laughs> this bride is about to get the surprise of a lifetime. In 2015, Becky Turney's son Tristan died when he was just 19 years old. He happened to be an organ donor and donated his heart to save someone else's life. Two years later, when Becky was getting remarried, her partner arranged to fly in the man who received Tristan's heart. And this is the magical, emotional moment that she found out. And one of those young men who received his heart is here today. So Jacob, could you please come up, buddy? The man who received the heart, Jacob Kilby, ended up serving as a groomsman during the wedding. And later, Becky got the chance to hear her son's own heartbeat on her special day. They say that dogs are a man's best friend, but for one family, their dog Henry is also a hero. Kelly Dowling says she was putting her nine-month-old infant down to sleep in her crib, just like she does every night. At the time, nobody knew that her baby was having trouble breathing. Nobody, except for the family's eight-year-old Boston Terrier. He could sense that something was wrong, so he kept barging into the baby's nursery and waking her up. He was not acting like himself, that he kept going back in. It seemed very belligerent and unusual for him. It was so unusual that when Kelly went to investigate, she noticed her daughter was turning blue. Take a look, you can see Kelly's husband rushing into the local children's hospital, desperate for help. Doctors were quickly able to clear her airways, and she returned home back safe and sound later that night. Since posting the story on Twitter, Kelly says her inbox has exploded with tributes and congratulations and people saying something that we can all agree on. Henry is a good boy. This is Hassan Dervish. Now, you've probably never heard of him before, but in his small neighborhood in Southeast London, he was a legend. You see, he drove an ice cream truck for 40 years and knew most of the kids by their first name. Earlier this year, he lost his life to cancer, and when he did, the community stepped up with the most heartwarming funeral procession that you'll ever see. This is a line of ice cream trucks all playing their music and following the funeral procession to honor the 62-year-old Hassan. The video was posted onto social media and quickly became viral. Hassan was so popular that he served ice cream to multiple generations of the same family. We want to take you to Rhode Island next, where a young boy has a much easier trek to school thanks to the handiwork of a few local students. Ryder Killam was born with spina bifida and has never been able to walk. So getting from his front door to his school bus isn't exactly easy, especially in the winter. So Ryder's father, Tim, reached out to a local high school to see if they could help. Students responded by building this custom-made bus shelter just for him. They added things like a window and a heater to help Ryder stay safe while he was waiting for the bus. This week, Ryder met the students of Westerly High School, and as you can see, Ryder was thrilled. Over in Ireland, this dog shelter is celebrating Christmas in a very special way. They give their dogs a chance to choose their own Christmas toys. Now, imagine being a puppy and walking into a room filled with things like, I don't know, bouncy balls, stuffed animals, and the best chew toys a dog could wish for. It's kind of like a doggy heaven on earth. And before we go this week, we want to wish each and every one of you a happy holidays. Look, we know it's been a really difficult year for a lot of people, but hang in there, you got this. And as we go, we want to show you footage of an incredible rescue in Malaysia where a group of kittens was trapped during historic flooding and rescuers came by boat to save them. Thanks for watching, everybody. Stay safe, have a happy holidays, and stay goodable.